This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on hackerarsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. I'm Marley Oxenome from Pentester Academy TV, and welcome to our show, Access Point, where we spotlight cybersecurity companies and give an inside look at the people and technology behind the latest advancements in the industry. Today, I will be speaking with the company Cobalt. I'm sitting down right now with Espen Fries Jensen, who is going to walk us through a platform demo. Take it away. Thank you. Absolutely. So, uh, we're just going to dive right into it. Um, so, uh, basically, Cobalt is this uh, pen testing platform that allows you to uh, run a pen test and uh, work directly with uh, pen testers. The whole idea behind it is basically that you can uh, spin up uh, a pen test, mm -hmm. uh, we'll match a team to it, um, and then uh, you'll start receiving findings. So, I'm just going to run you through uh, this workflow. Okay. Um, so the first page we land on here is basically a dashboard uh, where you can see all the pen tests you're currently running. Uh, you can see the start date and end date. You can see the current state of findings and mm -hmm. so forth. If we dive uh, a bit deeper into an individual pen test, uh, you can see here how it's defined uh, by what is in scope, what is the objective, like testing for OWASP sub 10 application logic. Uh, you can also give uh, additional details here uh, about the scope. Based on the scope in question, uh, a team will be assigned. Uh, so a team of three is typically uh, the standard with us, uh, a lead and two domain experts. Mm -hmm. um, and when that team has been assigned, they will start testing. Uh, a typical pen test with Cobalt runs for two weeks, uh, but it can also be customized. Um, the cool thing is, uh, as the testing runs, you get all the findings in real time. So you don't have to sit around and wait for the test to end, basically. Oh, wow. Um, and they come in in a structured way like this, so you can kind of have a nice list view uh, of everything. Um, the cool thing is uh, that we kind of have a workflow built into the whole finding flow. So initially they will be in a waiting, which means the researchers are still wait, uh, working on them, uh, assigning criticality and so forth. Uh, then they will move to pending fix, which means they're ready for the customer to fix them. Uh, but then we don't uh, just stop there. We actually help on the patch verification, so the whole retest and, and going all the way to resolution. Um, if we dive a bit deeper into an individual pen, uh, pen test finding, um, it looks like this. So you have a mm -hmm. title, type, criticality, description, steps to reproduce, suggested fix. Uh, but then we also have this direct uh, communication uh, chain here where you can ask questions to the, to the researcher uh, and the business and oh, tester wow. can communicate. Okay. We have I integrations with issue tracking, so we know it's not necessarily that uh, people want to invite everybody into their platform, so they can kind of uh, uh, integrate with different kind of uh, tools, so mm -hmm. they can push the content of the issues into those. So what we're looking at here is, is the, the platform from kind of like a, um, a business perspective. Mm -hmm. The researchers would, of course, see uh, some somewhat of the same, but they would have more like a, a submission workflow. They will submit the issues instead of receiving them. Right. Okay. Uh, but it's basically the same interface. Uh, part of the delivery is also these summary views. Uh, so we all kind of build out these graphs based on the individual findings. Okay. Um, and you also get, so we took the old school PDF report uh, that you get from consultancies and build it into the platform as a live document. Uh, so it has everything you kind of known from those kind of documents like methodology, mm -hmm. recommendations, etc. Very detailed. Um, it can then be downloaded as PDF, wow. uh, but, but it's not a PDF out of uh, ordinary. Okay. So, so this is like uh, just an example of an individual uh, pen test. Mm -hmm. um, the true power of Cobalt is really that it can be used to run multiple pen tests uh, from a, a customer perspective. From a researcher perspective, it means you can also get access to, uh, to test on multiple products, mm -hmm. which is really interesting. Um, so, so those are some of the powers of Cobalt becoming this system of record, both for the customers running or getting pen tests done, but also for the testers uh, doing their work. Um, so they can keep track of everything, uh, past results, past findings, and you can kind of look at trends and analytics across uh, different uh, pen tests. Okay. 
So this was the short and dirty kind of description of yep, the whole yep. platform. I think the last cool thing I just want to show is the, uh -huh. is the researcher profiles. Um, so we have a, a, a rating system uh, where the, the, oops, wrong link here. Sorry about that. That's okay. Um, so uh, we have a hall of fame. Oh. So all the researchers get rated uh, both by their peers, but also the customers. Oh, that's cool. And they earn points. Um, so every single uh, researcher will have a, a profile. So let's take Robert here from Germany. Mm -hmm. uh, you can look at his social media profiles, look at that description, uh, his skills. Wow. Uh, how his report quality is. This is Very a rating cool. out of five, uh, zero to five, and how he rank uh, compared to other researchers. Mm -hmm. So we're also trying to gamify it a bit um, and making it a bit fun mm -hmm. uh, while also kind of showing who these researchers are so they're not just... Uh, a uh, bad guy it's <laughs> um, uh, these guys are really transparent about who they are which is i think a new thing in the security industry wonderful very cool thank you so much uh, for showing me this demo this was yeah, great you're welcome thank you absolutely all right and that's all the time we have for today so be sure to tune in next time for another episode of access point also make sure to subscribe to our youtube twitter and facebook so you don't miss out on any of the latest cybersecurity news this episode is brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on hackerarsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.